I was helping a church. They were working on a house to make it uh, better and then sell it to a low-income family. I went to s step on the extendable ladder, ladder and uh, must have set it up a little bit wrong, wrong, and it collapsed whenever I stepped on it. On it so I fell 13 feet and landed on my uh, back, had a burst fracture. The EMT took off my boots and I didn't even know. Oh, and he went, and can you feel me touching your foot? And I was like, N no. And uh, he went, all right, we got to get you life lighted. We were getting ready for surgery. They were saying, and you're probably not going to walk again, but we're going to try to do our best. And and uh, that one hit pretty hard. After that, then we went to the rehab, trying to get my motor functions back and uh, the bowel and bladder training and uh, working on strengthening up and working on what diff how I'd have to go through day to day. Every therapist was real helpful, real nice, and they helped push you. They didn't let you stay complacent. I did uh, weight training, which at first it was like the one pound weight which they made pink. So it's like, it's like a double insult. It's like, oh, I can only lift the one pound weight and it's pink? Come on. I want to try to be as independent as possible, which I'm kind of getting there. Still not there all the way, but I'm working on it. Sled hockey really helps with that because it's a lot of digging into the ice and a lot of balance control. It's something they keep you positive or like keep me motivated in it because it's I want to get better at doing stuff of because uh, I all of them can just go from the ground and f transfer right up into their chair no problem um like it motivates me to want to do that it's called UPMC Rehabilitation Institute but to me, Ben Bevington, is to get back in the game and stay.